Hello, kids. Welcome back. We're on part three of the Butterfly Hospital, and I'm your teacher, Brian. We're continuing with the story about the four sick butterflies. Nege Nabi Apayo. Is that right? Okay. There are four butterflies that are sick. Their wings are damaged, crumpled, or torn. Let's continue the story. What do you see in this picture? We see grandma here, and we see uh, the, the boy here, and what are they doing? It looks like they have a tray of food, and they're putting the food in the butterfly hospital. Let's read together. Now grandma feeds the butterflies every day. She puts them in the sun when she goes to work, right? Inside the house, she puts them, the sun comes in the window, right? She puts them in the sun when she goes to work. She puts them outside, peke, right? When she is at home. So when she's home, she can put them outside because she can see them. Here, Grandma is putting the butterfly hospital outside. She's at home. She rounds up, rounds up, round up to gather like moda, moda, to collect, to gather. She rounds up the butterflies when it is time for bed. Okay? Jimdei kayo, right? Chaljao, right? Chaljao, you know, kachi. So she rounds up the butterflies. Come here, come here, come here. You know, because the butterflies, right, are moving around. She has to round them up. Grandma has a little dog, right? Kangaji seo. Chagen kangaji. He, he, the little dog, he helps with the roundup too, right? So think about the little dog. Bong, 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 bong. Hey, come here, Nobby. Come on. Let's get together. It's time to sleep. It's time for bed. So they round up the butterflies. It's time for bed. Here's the little doggy, Kiyopchi, right? Kiyopchi doggy. And he helps to round up to gather the butterflies. It's time for bed. The butterflies cannot fly well, but they have a good life with Grandma. And we have four friends to play with at Grandma's place. So that's great. What can we see in the picture? We can see Grandma. Can we see her dog? Yes, we see her dog right here. He's a white dog with a black patch on its eye, over its eye. A black patch of fur over its eye. There's the doggy. Good doggy. Chalheo, right? And here are the kids. They are the grandchildren. They are interested in butterflies. So they are telling the story. Here is one butterfly that is in the butterfly hospital. We can see the wing is crumpled or torn. So, do you see another butterfly? You see this boy here? He looks very concerned. He's worried. Do you see here? There is a butterfly on his arm. He's caring for the butterfly, and he is protecting the butterfly. Mm, that's very good. So, they will take care of the four butterflies. Even though they have, they cannot fly, their wings are damaged, they have a good life. They have food. They have fruit, flowers, and honey water to eat. And Grandma takes good care of the butterflies. When the grandchildren, the boy and girl, go to Grandma's house, they have four friends. Who are the four friends? The four friends 
are the four nabi, the four butterflies. They can play with them at grandma's place, at grandma's house, right? Halmoni wi jeep, right? Grandma's house, grandma's place. Okay, that's a good story. That was a true story. It really happened. Maybe these are the actual people that this happened to, right? So that's very interesting. When you are at your house, look around. Can you find any chrysalis in the spring, little caterpillars? Maybe you can take one home, see if it changes into a butterfly. If it has good wings, you can let it go, watch it fly away. If it has crumpled or torn wings, you can make a butterfly hospital yourself. That would be chemisoil. Okay, well that ends our book for today, ends our lesson. I hope you learned a lot. We'll see you next time. Take care.